so that's the last photo. Psych! One day we will like, I, I want to share our story, like financial story, to let you know like anything is possible. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. I am just getting off work and starting work again. Um, yeah, you guys know the, role, the drill with that. Um, I've got some paperwork that I need to um, get done today. I've got a pretty packed afternoon, I will say. So, luckily I cooked a dinner on Saturday, so we've got enough for the week, or for the next couple days. So, anyway, I've got to go through my planner for this week. I haven't even done that, so that's great. <laughs> I'm just setting myself up for success, right? Um, anyway, so work has picked up tremendously, um, and I'm just trying to get used to it, and then obviously juggle two jobs at the same time, so... <sighs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm using the freaking memory card that I didn't want to use. I can't remember, did I? I think that was a dream. <laughs> that was definitely a dream. I had a dream that I switched out my memory cards and I definitely did not. Okay. Also, I need to find my tripod because I don't remember where I dropped that off. Oh! That. I still have like 50 million and one things to do. I think I said that already though. All right, I also need to get a new charger. This is the original charger that it came with and it's not looking too good, like at all. <laughs> also, laundry is just piled up as usual. As soon as I get done doing one load and putting it up, another load just appears out of thin air. Anyway, oh, yesterday, got these bad boys these are like the wheat mexican wheat snacks i got these i had these for the first time when i was in california in la obsessed put some lime juice or limon as they say and some valent and valentine's hot sauce or how do they pronounce it i'm not sure i'm pretty sure that's how so good so i got some from the store yesterday i literally already had three packs and <laughs> so good looking for a jewelry like travel jewelry, jewelry bag and I almost bought one on Amazon and I went to Goodwill the other day do not ever sleep on Goodwill by the way and I got this for 99 cents literally I was looking at one just like this just like this off of Amazon for like $20 99 cents and it looks brand new like no it's not a scratch on this so I was so happy about that we got a new, um, so we originally we have one in our area, but um, it's like over, way over crowded. Um, so they built another one on the other side of town and we finally went to it and it's awesome. We got, Kenny got a bunch of shirts, um, all, sorry, my breath. Kenny got a bunch of shirts, um, all for like, we got all the stuff we got for like 20 bucks all together. I got some other things, I can't remember what else I got. Mm. I also got a rain jacket and the rain jackets I was looking for on Amazon as well people it was, didn't have like the best reviews um so that's why I kind of peeled off on buying it which was a blessing because the one I got from Goodwill yesterday was like $4.99 like literally the brand I wanted and everything so another win for our trip so all the stuff on our on my like to get list for our trip, I'm definitely gonna try Goodwill before I get it first. The strawberry one is definitely better. Where did I put my tripod? Whew, that's strong. 
good though. Also found my other camera battery and charger that I've been looking for for forever. So that's nice. It was on Kenny's side of the bed. Oh, I need to turn this paperwork in before I forget. Where is my pen? So must do it in pencil first before I screw something up. Okay. <laughs> Paperwork's done. I have to do some math calculations in my head, so. Or not in my head, but I have to do some. And sometimes it can get a bit wonky in my head. <laughs> so I'm gonna look at my to-do list. I always have a to-do list, um, and I've got a lot to do. I also have a meeting that I have to head to at like, what, 5.30ish? So that's great. So I'm gonna crank out the work real quick and then I will get back with you guys in a second. Hey guys, my brain is officially fried. So fried, <laughs> but I'm learning. I basically completed all these tasks by myself. I mean, we obviously work as a team, but I'm just a quick learner like that, I guess. <laughs> and I figured everything out, so. I've gotta get ready for my mating that we're having. And also dinner, I, I already mentioned that already. Not that you guys even care, like, who even asked, right? Um, I need to run out before our meeting, actually. I think I'm going to, oh, my socks are right here. I think I'm going to sport these cute boots. Do not even come for me for my toes. I am going to get a pedicure one day. I am beyond grateful. Lighting. Um, beyond grateful for this opportunity, you guys. Kenny and I have come so far, like job wise. I mean, he's. He is always um, like, we've been, you, I, you guys know, or me, or may not know, we're in the military. Um, Kenny, we, um, he was deployed for a year, a year in our, of our relationship. He's literally deployed like three times. Um, but back from deployment, we had like, his dad was sick. Um, so we handled a lot of that. We weren't working around that time. Um, I think we were, he was on leave. Yeah, he used his leave days for like that whole summer and we were taking care of his dad and we didn't have a job. Um, I had just graduated graduated from college and I was using my leave days as well because I um, am in the military too, but in the guard, if you're activated for like more than 90 days, you're technically active guard or whatever. Anyway, so we, in a nutshell, we were using our leave days and we got, we decided to, when we decided to move to the area that we're in, it was, I found a job actually pretty quickly. Um, and so, and Kenny was still like doing military things. Um, but we wanted to get to a point where we weren't like so dependent on the military to like live, you know? We wanted to, obviously I had just graduated from college and I wanted to do something with my degree or like obviously like start my life and get a job or whatever. And I ended up not like liking the job I was in, but I stayed in it obviously. And then I ended up getting deployed, you know, during COVID times. Um, and that like literally saved our ass. I cannot even, one day we will like, I, I want to share our story, like financial story and all of that stuff with you guys to let you know like anything is possible. Uh, but anyway, um, just with this job, like, I try to be, and even with my day job, as hard as it can be sometimes mentally, um, I always, like, try to, like, have gratitude and be thankful and be grateful. And, like, I just can't believe we're here. Like, 
um we're married we've been through so much you guys oh my god there was i have stories for days um i know like i come on here and like obviously you all see the good but there's bad too like literally as y'all know if you know you know um and just like having a stable job and like literally working from home what the heck was my dream and I try to be thankful and I know I just went off on this whole tangent but I, I, I was saying like I was like procrastinating going back to work which I'm, I am but I'm not like I'm fine with that but I literally feel like finally I'm living the life that I prayed for for so long and I just want you guys to know if I can do it you definitely can moving out on your own um, and then moving in with someone like in your 20s like it's a lot especially millennials y'all it's hard out in these streets for us and we have degrees and it's just like a new i think it's just like a new day and age and things change you know when our when our parents went to school and got a degree like it was pretty much set in stone like they would find a job but now it's just not like that and it's hard it really is and it's not about what you know it's who you know nowadays and anyways i just like i am so grateful like oh my god i cannot believe it like we literally we almost we're we're almost like there you know i feel like we made it for the most part um together you know we did it together um but you can do it by yourself too you don't need you don't need no man and that's one thing i don't need kenny and kenny doesn't need me we we, we are together because we want to be together. And that's very important as well. But anyway, I'm in the laundry room for something. I think I was checking, oh, the dryer. And, uh, yes. Okay, so that's the last load of, psych! I was like, that's the last load of laundry. That is, we have another load, awesome. Well, that's nice. I need to sweep this laundry room though because it's driving me nuts. Your favorite friend, Left me some dust bunnies. If you guys are wondering where we got this from, we got it from Supply. We got it from the Supply Sergeant somewhere. It's a secret though. You have to be friends with the Supply Sergeant so you can get, ooh, so you can get cool stuff. Here are my sandals I've been looking for. Ooh, it was so dirty. Yikes. That was literally bothering me for a second. I need to take care of that before I went crazy. Okay. What time is it? I need to go run my errand. I always have an errand right before I have a meeting or something that I need to get done. Um. Anyways. What time is it? Oh, I've got like no time. <laughs> okay, let me put my shoes on. I literally went to do that. My brain is all over the place. Bear with me, y'all. I promise you. I will get my life together one of these days. Or maybe not, because I just tried to put the shoe on the wrong foot. Court, get it together, girl. Okay. I'll put this cute. On. I got this from Francesca's years ago at this Black Friday sale and I have literally been wearing it ever since. I need to figure out what I'm wearing to work tomorrow. Also, you like my hair? I got it done this weekend on Friday. Right, so I'm gonna pass this camera off to Kenny Burke because by the time I get back he'll be home So I'm gonna leave a note for him to use the camera and I'll see you guys tonight or later Okay. She talking about use me I'm as fuzzy as shit There it is She talking about use me <laughs> I use you I got some McDonald's she texting me now talking about Talking about what you got, LOL. <laughs> I ain't got nothing. McDonald's. Okay. Gotta go to the bathroom. I'll holler.